Hey, Megan Scully, and this is the Limerick Post Show, and joining me now from Darkness into Light, Limerick, it's Johnny Tour. How are you getting on? Megan, hi, how are you? Thanks very much for having us. Well, it's great to be chatting again, of course. Darkness into Light is back. It's a native Pieta house. It's happening this weekend. It's been going on for quite a number of years now, but this is hugely important to not just Pieta House, but I think to the people of Limerick too. Yeah, I mean, this, this is the actual 10th walk I think I've been involved in. And would you believe it or not, last year was the first year I actually got to do the circle because it was a, sun, a sunrise appeal and we didn't have an official walk. Uh, myself and my daughter went in and, and we walked the three bridges last year. I, I just couldn't get over it, the amount of people that turned up and walked. And, and it was fabulous, you know. So this is, I think this should be the, the either the 12th walk, I think, in Limerick. And, and in that time, it's kind of grown from strength to strength. And it, it's, as you know yourself, it's, it's just an, an amazing um, event, really. It really is, you know. Um, so we're really looking forward to it. And it, it looks like the weather forecast is going to be very kind to us again this year. Brilliant. Yeah, because I think it was probably, it was 2019 we did the last one together. I know you and yeah. I met, we're saying, early yeah, in the hours did, in the morning. And it was brilliant. And it was, it's, it's such a like magical event to go around. And I, even now there, I think it was last year, the year before, I um, got out up, up for sunrise. And I remember I took a, a sunrise time-lapse video um, here in Limerick. And like, as you said, I could see yellow t-shirts dotted around. And you know what? It was yeah. so nice because it showed people still want to get out even you know, in their own space and in their own time. But now we can all get back together. We can all gather together. We can all be there together. And um, want to talk about the location this year. It'll be kicking off from the TUS Moilish campus. Um, kicks off Correct. at four fifteen a.m. and it's Saturday yeah. night, which some people call Friday Friday yes. night Saturday morning. Friday night Saturday morning. Yeah. Friday night Saturday morning, which is the seventh. Um, you know, and you know, I think um, Johnny, it's really important that everyone gets to go out and do this together again, like twenty nineteen and previous years. Yeah, I think there's something about being together, you know, I suppose you can, it's a show of solidarity, really, to people who have lost loved ones to suicide, you know, and it's it's just, it's when you come back as well, just to have the chat and have a cup of tea, and I suppose, look, th this year we, we have a slight change of venue, we were very, very lucky because we didn't have to change the route, so it's the traditional route that we would leave, we leave the tourist campus, as you say, and we'll travel down on to Hassett's Cross, turning right, down Shelburne Road, through Union Cross, onto the Salesian Roundabout, where we'll meet the Clondell Road and turn left across the new bridge, as we call it, um, right down by the quay, by the river, at the back of Arthur's Quay, up onto Patrick Street, down to St. Mary's Church, turning left up the Island Road, past King John's Castle, and back out Sexton Street North, back out to Tuas LIT, where, you know, there'll be a cup of tea and a, cu a cup of coffee waiting, and, and hopefully a muffin as well. So. It's absolutely wonderful. You know, we, we should say, of course, Mr. Ed Sheeran is in town, and I think a lot of people are going to be around Limerick for those gigs. So yes. I think why not make a weekend of it? If you're going to the gig on the Thursday or the Friday, you know, Saturday um, early morning, you can head on out and support Darkness into Light Limerick. Now, I do know that there's other locations in Limerick. It's not just the city centre. Correct. There's there's two other locations this year. We have Maru, which is a beautiful walk around uh, Glenstall Abbey. And we also have Kilmella. Now, normally we would have Newcastle West as well, but unfortunately, due to unforeseen circumstances, we had to cancel Newcastle West, but we, we're assured it will be back bigger and stronger again in 2023. I think it's great, though, to have, you know, the, the county included as well, because I guess it might be hard logistically for people to get into the city centre at that time of the morning. So I think it's great that they'll all be able to get involved. And I should remind people, darknessintolight.ie is the link there to register. You can still register. There's still time, isn't there, Johnny? Yeah, you can register right up to the night. No, the only thing is that you probably won't get your t-shirt before the walk no but i'm just encouraging people wear an old t-shirt wear anything yellow and just come out and support the cause that's really the message for the people of Limerick because you know the people of the midwest in general have been so good to be in and so I'm, I'm very confident we're going to have a massive crowd there on, on friday night saturday morning and i and i just i hope everything you know from an, from an organization if you goes goes to plan and everybody gets home safe that's what it's all about and you mentioned it too megan we we don't have bottles of water this year we're hoping that people will will bring their own water you know because it's to do with i suppose you know plastics and, and trying to i suppose environmentally be environmentally friendly absolutely i think if everyone just takes a, a check at home i think we all have 
you know, uh, yes. Gareth says light t-shirts. We all have that yellow t-shirt somewhere. And if not, ask your yeah. friends, ask your family. They've got them somewhere. Yeah. And I think it's yeah. a good way as well to kind of um, reduce and reuse and use the ones that you already have. Yeah. As I mentioned there, darknessintolight.e, it's the website to register. A few more days now. It is, of course, happening as we say, Friday night, but early Saturday morning, kicking yeah. off at 4.15 a.m. from the TUS Moilish campus and Kilmallock and, of course, Maru as well. Johnny Tower of Darkness into Light, as always, a pleasure to chat to you. And I know this is an extremely important event for Paid House, and I know the people of Limerick will turn up. Thanks, Megan. You're very good. And thank you to all your listeners as well. And I hope to see everybody on Saturday night in Grateful. Thank you, Megan.